This looks like a scene at a World War II, but what exactly is Super Mario doing there? Well, actually, this is from 1994. You see, that year, a shipment of 10,000 bootleg Game Boy games was intercepted from Hong Kong at an airport in the Netherlands. Rather than merely dispose of the contraband, Nintendo decided to put on a little bit of a show. You see, at that time, they were in the middle of launching a global anti-piracy initiative. So they decide they're gonna have the actual, real-life Super Mario go to that airport and lead his crew in dumping the boxes of illegal games onto the ground. A steamroller comes and crushes all the games as Super Mario looks on, with the images to be distributed in the Dutch media as a warning to any potential bootleggers. To this day, Nintendo is probably the most aggressive video game company when it comes to enforcing their copyrights. And I could almost respect it if they always had this much fun with it.